Hi, I'm Reinhold. I'm a physicist, and this is how to determine the center of mass. If your system is composed of two different particles, and a line connects the two, you can label each with a mass. This has m1. Your second particle has m2. And we can say that m1 is positioned at x1, and m2 is positioned at x2. Now, the equation for center of mass in the x direction is simply xcm is equal to the summation from i equals 1 to n total number of particles. And inside of the summation for each particle, for instance, looking at particle 1, we want to take particles, the particle's mass, and we want to multiply by the particle's position. And once we've done this for all particles, the summation, we want to divide by the total mass. And in this example above, we find that the center of mass is equal to m1 x1 plus m2 x2 divided by m1 plus m2. Now this equation looks slightly foreign possibly. And in order to test its validity, think about just one particle being here. If we set m2 equal to 0, it's kind of like m1 is existing only by itself. So if we do set m2 to 0, this term would go to 0, this one would go to 0, and we find that x center of mass is m1 x1 over m1, which simply reduces to x1. So we know this equation is valid for this two particle system above. I'm Ryan Alt. This is how to determine the center of mass. Music